The first thing that we're going to do to make these cute little chicks and rabbits, these are pieces that I just cut out of the bottom of an egg carton. So I just carefully cut kind of around the bottom um, and around the sides. So just here are some that I paint that I cut out. And then for the rabbits, you're going to paint the shell white like I did this one right here. And for the little chickies, we're going to paint those yellow. So, perfect little springtime project. My boys are excited to make these with me. This is my lazy way of painting. Eh, don't have to get anything else dirty. I just squirt right on there. This is one um, coat. It depends if you want a really thick layer, do t let the first um, layer dry and then you can do a second layer. Or if you kind of want the, the homemade look, you can just go ahead and use one layer and it'll be just really cute. So we'll let these dry and then we'll decorate. For our bunny's ears, um, I did something really simple. I took a sheet of pink glitter cardstock out of one of our mat stacks. And um, I had punches on hand. If you can hand cut these or use another um, die cutting system. But I did ovals. And for the small, this is one ear you'll see. So for the inside of the ear, I just punched a small pink oval. And then... For the back, the same pink paper, I did a larger one, and then I just turned it over to use the white side and glued it down towards the top a little bit. And that way when you're looking at the bunny from the back you still see the cute pink. Then once um, I glued that down, I folded this piece so there's a little ledge, and that's how we're going to glue on. We'll put the adhesive on that little ledge and then we'll glue it to the back. Okay, so here's my finished bunny. For his um, eyes, I just had a ballpoint pen that I just did tiny little eyeballs. And then for his nose, I did a um, halfback pearl. You could use a little button. You could do a tiny little punch of paper. Um, whatever you want. And then for his little white feet, I just did two more of the small punches and um, put little little um, foot, footprints and then you can see how I folded those and glued those to the inside. So, so here's my little duo. Um, you can see the little chicky. I just hand cut his wings and just glued him to the side. And then his little feather on top, I cut also, just hand cut, and I did this side double-sided. I used paper from our lemon flower stack that just barely came out, the perfect spring colors. And then for his little feet, I just used regular orange cardstock, and also for his beak. So you can kind of see the two together. I hope that you enjoyed watching this tutorial, and I would love to see any of these little guys that you make yourself. My guys are dying to make their own bunny and chicks, so that's what we're off to do right now. A great kids project. Thanks for watching and have a great day.